Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. Most homes here in the Twin States have guns, whether for hunting or protection or for both. Many people are trained and keep their firearms locked away. However, a gun left out can be deadly. Nationwide Children's Hospital reports 1,300 children die each year in the U.S. from similar situations. And that's one reason Columbus police are making a push to give away gun locks. WCBI's Desmond Matthews joins us now live with more. Joey and Andrea, a five-year-old girl, was accidentally shot with an unattended gun in Columbus. She is now at home recovering, but Police Chief Fred Shelton tells me that a simple gun lock like this one could have avoided that near tragedy. We're not against legal gun owners having guns. We just want them to be safe with it. It happens more than you might think. Adults leave a gun where it can accidentally end up in a child's hands. After a five-year-old girl was accidentally shot in the head, the Columbus Police Department is implementing an extra cautionary step. If the weapon is not being used and you're not being threatened and you got landing land around your house for protection, you simply put this gun lock on it, especially if you have small children. Fred Shelton is the chief of police in Columbus. He said gun locks are easy to use, but he says the first step in gun ownership is to learn how to safely use a weapon. I would suggest that you go get with your local police department and let them give you a class on how to properly load your weapon, unload your weapon, and to actually go down to the range and fire a few rounds through that weapon. Then once you learn how to use it properly, then you need to learn how to properly store it. The department teaches adults safety rules on using the gun and tries to prevent gunshot cases with children and untended guns. What we teach on the range about, you know, firearm safety, uh, keeping your hand off the trigger and certain things as far as with an adult. But um, we have had cases here and all around the world where the kids find the gun and, and, and that's an unfortunate situation. Eric Lewis is a firearm instructor for the Columbus Police Department. Unfortunately, he has seen several children die or be severely injured with guns, and he feels it stems from toy guns being widely used and kids' curiosity. So many guns that can be bought from Walmart and places that are toys, and they'll pick it up thinking it's just a toy, and next thing you know, something, you know, dangerous happened or something that, you know, that we can't reverse. Any weapon can be used for protection, but police remind owners to put their family safety first. A lot of people carry guns for safety reasons, safety measures, but it's very important to make sure that you pay attention to what you do with that gun at all times. That gun is a, a, a deadly weapon. Chief Shelton said gun locks are free. All you have to do is come up to the police station and ask for one, but they are limited to one per household. Reporting live in Columbus, Desmond Matthews, WCBI News.